Hello guys, this is Alan from Community Satire and we're going to be playing Prey today. This is just the demo by the way. Let's see. What the? By the way, I, I intended to choose male on that. Did not intend to choose female. But whatever, we're gonna go with it because why not. Just a, uh, a kind of heads up by the way, we also were trying to record some Minecraft Let's Plays as well as I will be doing a solo let's play of All the Way Through Prey. I am also doing it on hard mode, as you kind of saw at the beginning of the episode there. And I do hope everybody's having a good day today. Let's see. As this game, as we wait on this game to load. So we're loading into our apartment. This game is supposed to be placed on like a space station or something like Telus 1, I believe it is. What the heck are we doing in an apartment? Oh, there it goes. Maybe. Come on. Or not. Hey, there we go. So that's a neat loading symbol. Let's see. <sighs> Press A. Alright. This is kind of strange. Morning, Morgan. Today is Monday, March 15th. 2032. Okay, so this is like 15 years in the future. Cool. So we're gonna be getting killed by aliens in 15 years. Alright, so this is interesting. It's like a normal apartment. This is actually like high class. Okay, so we're seeing skyscrapers and whatnot. There's a... It's a very high-tech mp3 play right there. Let's see. Hey, Morgan. Not grab that. Wake up. You're burning daylight. You sent the helicopter to pick you up. It's just a few tests. Don't forget to wear your suit. I obviously so. need this. Oh, listen, I'm uh, really great you decided to come on board. We're gonna shake things up, Morgan. Like old times. So this is supposed to be done all in space, right? Like, why, why am I... Well, I guess this is kind of like the beforehand. You're going into the office. You're kind of learning what you're doing and whatnot. Okay, so we're drinking green tea. That's a good thing. That's pretty healthy. It's pretty nice. Let's see here. Wait. Can I pick up things? I'm carrying this with me. This is coming with me for the rest of the game. Or not. <laughs> I didn't mean to throw it. I thought, the X, I thought X was just a drop. Let's see here. Let's try this. Yeah, X is drop. Why did it throw it? Here we go. That was a tensional throw. Uh, let's see here. Hands on electronics. Neat. Uh, throw this out of the way. Cause why not? Password. We have three emails. Uh, you guys can kind of pause on the screen uh, to read these. I've actually already played through a little bit of this, so some of my reactions may not be entirely genuine. So apologies on that one. But um, yeah, you guys can just uh, kind of pause to read through these. I've already read through all of them because. You obviously need to read every single thing that comes out of these things because some of them actually will tell you like story and whatnot. Also, things you guys don't want to notice, there may be some repetitiveness to some of those notes. So um, I can grab a controller, but I can't play anything. Wait, can I see my feet? Neat. Am I wearing shorts? Alright then. An account of... Fermi, I guess? Fermi's question... Huh. It's pretty interesting. Galactic Nine Conquest Conquistadors. Alright then, why are the spaceships upside down though? Oh well. <laughs> Vase. Nope. Okay then. He has a lot of books on the shelves and whatnot. Um... Okay, so I guess that's pretty much everything in this room that I know of. Oh wait, he's plastic tubing. I don't know what this is used for yet, but um, we'll take it anyway. Cause uh, resources, why not? I pick this up and keep this. Actually, you know what? No, I need a I need a bag. I need to take my suitcase so we can go to work. Let's see, where where is my suitcase? I had a suitcase. This will work, screw it. Wait. There we go. 
Morning, Stick him a beats to work. Hello, person. Stop it. No. <laughs> Heard there's a chopper on the roof. Must be for you. Taking your light. This is mine now. Wait, what's over here? This would be really cool if you could actually like carry this around like as a torch. Wait, what is that? Oh, aquarium. Little fish. Little fish. Okay, come this way. This way I can now run because if you hold things you can't actually sprint. Which I think is kind of weird, but uh, yeah. Let's go to the roof. Yeah, my torch is back. One floor, or 52 floors, technically speaking. Wait a minute. Was this down there? Alright. That's kind of weird, but okay. I didn't really think they would have the same thing on two floors. Uh, that's that's kind of weird. Um, let's do this. See what happens. I I completely missed it. All right, <laughs> that happens, I guess. So we're getting on a helicopter on the roof, so we can go to our job, our extremely well-paying job. I'm assuming. I mean, we're going into space. Comfortable, and we'll be on our way. And this is like a very high-class helicopter here. Seventy-eight degrees, clear skies. Does the salt really? Some nice product placement there. Enjoy that spear distribution. Nice. So, uh, what, what is that? JTG? What the heck is JTG? Uh, this music is pretty good. This scenery is amazing. It's awesome. What is that? That's a nice view on the bay there. On the bay? That? Is that the bay? I think. Um, Arcane Studios production. Nice. Kind of like where this is going so far. This is kind of a uh, kind of relaxing. You're just like flying in a helicopter. One. This is a very nice helicopter again. This is kind of interesting. Um, I don't know what I'm doing now. Let's see. Uh, oh, look, the name of the game. Pray. I like it. The name of the building is Prey. Here we are, Ms. Yu. Mind the glass on the way out. Good luck to you. Let's see. Ooh, I have a torch. I'll have to do this again now. It seemed really conspicuously placed. Uh, Hello, Dr. Yu. Hello, floating, like, suitcase. I'm a Sybil 495 science class operator. My instruments are calibrated for high volume data analysis and live readings. Don't worry, nothing will be missed. Our research often requires intense focus and long hours. I can provide you with a psychoactive stimulant after the test. If I'm necessary. Good. I'm good. Nope. Welcome, Wait, hold on. Morgan Yu. You have a 9 a.m. appointment in the testing Wait, facility. Wait, what is this? Please confirm. What happened here? Is this battery? What the heck is this? So, um... I don't know what that is. Wait. Is that a CD drive? It's like a CD drive to me. I don't know. Let's see, to the, uh, oh, you know, 101 floors is good. Let's see. It's like nothing here right now. It's like a normal elevator, I guess. Very symmetrical. Morgan! Finally! Okay, that's getting kind of weird. I think it's following me, but I'm happy about it. So I think this is like my brother. <laughs> you don't look terrible in a Transtar uniform. How's your eye? I didn't know how to do that. I know the test might seem a little <laughs> unconventional, but it's a you family tradition. <laughs> Breaking convention is in our blood. Wait, wait, can I show you on the face? Start yes. the test? Just do whatever comes natural. <laughs> Don't overthink it. Dr. Bellamy is going to walk you through the process. <laughs> You're in good hands. Let's see. We'll be in orbit next week. Next week? All right, so we, so we get to go over and do space Mr. next you, week. They're ready for your sister in room A. Right. Yeah. Listen. Let's see, room A. Just be yourself. I'll see you after. 
Okay. So that's uh testing rooms. Alright, let's do this. Okay. Hello people. Um Good morning, here. Morgan. Hello. I'm Dr. Bellamy. Looks like we have some tests to run. Giant forehead. Probably not the kind of thing you're used to, I imagine. What's else in there? What else is in there? Me, you're going to do fantastic. Uh, All good? Let's see what's in there. Let's Wait, what is that? For this first test, oh, floating suitcase. Remove okay. the boxes from the red circle as quickly as you can. I should probably listen to this. Go with your gut. Okay? Wonderful. Press the red button when you're ready. Okay, press the red button. I'm guessing it's this button. Wonderful. That's... You're absolutely fine. Uh, let's move on to room B, you seem then. I'm very unsure about something. What's wrong? Okay, this is room B. I think. Or second room, whatever. So I do. Okay, Morgan. Listen carefully. I'd like you to do your best to hide in this room. So I gotta hide Relax. in a completely open room no, I'm kidding. with nothing you to hide behind. Nine seconds. Okay, Hit let's the do red this. button when you're ready to start. <laughs> okay, let's do this. I am I am hidden, I think. Is she? <laughs> She's hiding behind the chair. Yep. This is the only mm, thing I can hide no. behind, so why not? Any synaptic register at all? So am I supposed to have powers or something? No. Like I don't get what I'm supposed to hide in That's this. Fine. Sorry, let's keep things moving, Morgan. Head into room C. Can I take this chair with me? Marvelous. Can I take this chair with me? Maybe. Come on. Yes. Yay. <laughs> Alright. Here we go. For this test, please press the blue button across the room as quickly as you can. In the most so doing this again. natural, intuitive way possible. Without thinking. Just, just go for it. Press the red button when you're ready. Okay. This, this is really strange. I'm sorry, can someone please explain to me what's happening? Simmons? Um, I what? saw exactly what Tina brought down. Did it's all what? Were you just telling me? Still on. I heard that. I apologize, Morgan. We're having some trouble with the equipment. What equipment? Not your what fault. Are you? You're what? doing fabulous, actually. One last room. Let's Let's also fly or something. What the heck is going on here? Uh, why are all the lights red? There's seven. Okay then. <laughs> I don't really know what's going on there. Um, whoa. Can someone get me a cup of coffee? I would appreciate it. Thank you. Okay. Okay, Morgan. Have a seat at the table for me, please. I might. Wonderful job. Take a look at the screen in front of you. I'm going okay. to show you a series of questions. Pick the answer that makes mm. the most sense to you. Press start on the screen when you're ready. So, um, let's see how to do this. Uh, uh let's see. It really uh, depends, like, if I'm going somewhere from, like, what? What was that noise? Let's go for somewhere familiar, I guess. Good. Looks like it's technically what I do it in real life anyway. Keep going. As soon as it does for your actions, how does this make you feel? Um, why is this a question? Let's see. You know what? You know what? It was worth it. Come on. Let's see. It was worth it. Ooh, that's heavy stuff. Yeah, as you said, it's me to death. Uh, it's a runaway train. It's bearing down on five people who are tied to the track. You can cause the train to switch tracks, but there is one person tied to the second track. So in essence, you're saving one, or saving four and sacrificing one. <coughs> so um, something I want to note here: there's actually a book series called the Gaia Trilogy, and there's actually a uh, a similar question to this in the same book or in the book. And essentially, the actual answer you're supposed to pick is do nothing. Let's see, a runaway train is bearing down on five people. You're sitting on a platform near an enormously fat man pushing you into the track would stop the train. How big is the guy that he would stop a train? Huh. 
On one hand, you're saving five people. On the other hand, you're literally pushing one guy into the train. I'm gonna go and do nothing. Almost done. Runaway train is buying. Why are they still on the track? You can stop the train by jumping on the track, but you would die. Why is this still an option? <laughs> huh. Alright, I'm gonna go with that one. Jump on the track, because that seems more of a wow. noble thing to do. I'm impressed. Well done. Well done. We're nearly through it. For um, this next okay. part, I'm going to display an image. Okay. I want you to take a good look at it. What? In a moment, I'm you guys saw that, right? You what, uh, <laughs> is my coffee? It's empty. <laughs> oh, God. So, dear God, what is that? What is this? Why? Why is the screen going? Why? It's not okay. It's freaking like died over here. <laughs> so like, I guess this is a good place as any to uh, pause the video for now. It's gonna be part one. Oh. Simmons, what's going okay. on? We have a problem. What about Morgan? She's alive, sedated. Clean it up. I'm on my way. Alright, so that'll be the end of part one. Um, I know this was kind of a quiet video. I know this was kind of a... Not as, I guess... What's the word for it? Uh, active, I guess? I don't know. But um, I do hope you guys enjoyed the video. I do hope you guys are having a good day. And thank you as always for watching our videos. We do hope you have a good day as well.